Hello everyone, my name is Spider the GB and I think this video has been long overdue for a long, long time. It's time I give you guys an update regarding the channel and what's been going on and sort of my plans for the uh, channel in the future. So, first of all, Minecraft. The uh, Fortress Service series, you guys may have realised, it was on a bit of a small hiatus and that's because I had a bit of a creative block when it came to thinking of more things to do or build on the server, but uh, you may have seen a couple of days ago that the series did return. We've got episode 32 gone out and we made ourselves a new animal barn which looks absolutely amazing. So go ahead and check it out. The series is not done, not by any stretch of the imagination. So, you know, still got a bunch of stuff I want to do on there. My uh, single player Python Plays Minecraft series, that's also still going. So, you know, no worries there at all. Nothing really too much going on with that. But, uh, well, I, I say that, but we got a massive freaking project that I'm doing. So, you know, that's kind of eating up a lot of time. So that's really nice. And the Skyblock series with Firestorm will pretty much be uploaded when I have the footage to do so. At the moment, I haven't actually got any more episodes of that recorded so you'll have to be patient obviously Firestorm is located in Canada I'm located in the UK I have a full-time job he has a full-time job he's got all kinds of things going on we've got time zones to consider so it's actually fairly rare that we're actually able to record but when we do so we tend to record for quite a long time so we do have content for you guys so hopefully you guys can understand that you know there's a lot of things a lot of aspects to consider when trying to sort of plan a recording date for that so yeah hopefully you guys can understand that so onwards to destiny so yeah my uh, first ever destiny multiplayer gameplay video went out a few days ago and uh, i was i was pretty pretty pleased to see the feedback on it there is no sort of set schedule for the destiny videos they'll pretty much be uploaded when i feel like uploading them there's not going to be a full let's play of destiny not the single player or anything like that because i kind of want you guys to sort of explore all for yourself i don't want to sort of release spoilers because the game's only very recently been released hasn't it so yeah hopefully you guys can understand that and yeah it's just going to be sort of the odd post commentary or maybe even live commentary on the multiplayer side of things so that'd be pretty cool and as I was saying before, I was pleased to see the uh, mostly positive feedback on the Destiny video. I appreciate it's not something I've done before on the channel, but uh, as you guys may or may not know, if you follow me on Twitter, I tend to put out a bunch of updates on there. So the Twitter link will be in the description, but I am trying to branch out my channel into new directions with new series on new games that I haven't tried before. So yeah, that'd be pretty cool. So yeah, I really don't want to be known for only doing Terraria or only doing to Minecraft. Doing to Minecraft. Yes, Python, you can talk. Great job, buddy. <laughs> oh, man. But yeah, I really don't want to be known for only doing Terraria or only doing Minecraft. I want to have fun making videos again. And so, you know, if I want to play something other than Minecraft Terraria, or, well, Minecraft or Terraria, should I say, then I'll go ahead and do it. I really don't want to be tied down to just one or two games on this channel because I feel like eventually I'll get burnt out. And obviously, if everybody's just subscribed for Terraria or everybody's just subscribed for Minecraft, then pretty much the channel's going to die. And that would kind of suck, wouldn't it? So, yeah. Secondly... Some of the feedback, I know it's kind of nitpicky, but some of the feedback was kind of predictable and I kind of want to address that. It's not really a complaint towards you guys, it's just an observation I made and it's, it's just a case of... I don't know, some of you guys seem to think that Titanfall was the first sort of futuristic first person shooter out there, even though it wasn't, there's been many, many of them before it, uh, but that really doesn't mean that any other ones are just like it, it's, to be honest, it's, it's a bit disheartening and quite frankly immature for you to have that viewpoint if you do, so, you know, any other games apart from Titanfall, they're not like Titanfall, so for example, we've got Call of Duty Advanced Warfare coming out, that's all futuristic, isn't it, so does that mean it's going to be like Titanfall? Who knows, I don't know, but uh, in my opinion, in my own opinion you really shouldn't be allowed to have a valid opinion on a game until you try it I mean you got to give the game a decent try actually get into the or try to get into the game at least before having a, uh, a proper valid opinion on it once you've done that then yeah by all means come back to me and say oh you're an idiot yeah, everything's like Titanfall but yeah if you haven't played the game you really shouldn't be saying them kind of things but yeah the other thing I wanted to address is if you're subscribed to this channel only for Terraria simply just go ahead and watch them videos it's, it's really disheartening to see people uh, well, mostly the Terraria people just come into my uh, non-Terraria videos and just being like, Oh, this sucks, do more Terraria content. That's, that's really not very nice. You really think that makes me want to do Terraria videos? No. No, it really doesn't. So, I don't know, just... I'm just trying to say, you know, just... For the Terraria people out there who are subscribed only for Terraria, just don't go out of your way to go ahead and click on a non-Terraria video and then proceed to dislike it and or flame me for making the video. Like like I said, it's really not very nice. It's it's not a very good source of motivation for making Terraria videos. In fact, it does quite the opposite. It really wants me not make want to make a Terraria video, sorry. And uh, talking of Terraria, let's move on to that. 
My god, has the channel exploded because of Terraria recently. It's been absolutely crazy, and the amount of support that has been shown for my Terraria videos has been absolutely insane, and I really cannot thank you guys enough for it. It's been one hell of a ride, and like I said, very much appreciated. Unfortunately, though, I will say this, I'm feeling like I'm approaching the end of my tether with Terraria. There's only so many times you can start a new world before things start becoming repetitive and therefore boring to watch, so I don't know, man. There's going to be some changes in the near future with Terraria content, uh, first of which I will be slowing down Terraria content for a little while. The reason why this is, is because I've kind of sort of burnt out on it, so, uh, you know, I kind of want to play it less and sort of explore different games, for example, Destiny, maybe do a bit more Minecraft, or maybe some other games that I might want to do, so, yeah. Once the Warrior playthrough is finished, I will be going down to just doing one Terraria series at a time. The Ranger playthrough is also still going, so, you know, both of them series are still going for now, but once once the Warrior playthrough is finished, it will be going down to just one series at a time. So, for example, the Ranger playthrough will be the only Terraria playthrough going out, uh, sort of, w when that happens, basically. So, yeah, but, you know, the Ranger playthrough is still going, so that's sort of no worries there. The only other things I really want to do in Terraria in terms of Let's Plays are the Mage playthrough, the Summoner playthrough, and eventually a uh, another full slash normal Let's Play once the 1.3 update fully comes out for Terraria. And then, once all of those series are done and dusted, that will... I don't know, that may or may not be the end of Terraria content for me on this channel, unless there's sort of future updates or anything like that. So, yeah. I mean, again, regarding Terraria, it's not the only thing being uploaded to this channel. I am not having this channel be a Terraria-only channel, nor will it ever be. So please, if you are here for Terraria, I beg of you, just... Just have a bit of patience, okay? Just be a bit patient and you will get your Terraria content. But yeah, I do like to do other things as well. So hopefully you guys can understand that. And the only other reason why I'm not able to upload more Terraria content or more content in general is because I have a full-time job in real life. So yeah, that kind of... That, that eats up most of my time. So again, for the most part, I can't upload more than one video per day. The only reason I was able to do so for the last week is because I had the live stream footage, which is... Uh, I think at the time of this video going out, there's like... Uh, in fact, I think of finished it now. By the time this video goes out, all of the uh, stream footage is pretty much done. So yeah, if you are here for Terraria, I'd appreciate it if you didn't go out of your way to click on dislike and leave negative comments on my non-Terraria content, because again, not very nice. It, it damages my motivation, and funny enough, you know, it makes me not want to play Terraria. So again, I just want to thank you guys for your continued support with the Terraria content. Like I said, it's been absolutely crazy, and I couldn't have got this far without you guys, so from the bottom of my heart, truly, thank you. Thank you so much. Now! Onto the nice things, onto the good things, the future series, the things I have planned for the future. Firstly, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare will be released on the 4th of November 2014, which, funnily enough, is my birthday. <laughs> for the 4th of November is my birthday, and Call of Duty Advanced Warfare is officially being released on that date, but since I've pre-ordered it, their pre-order bonus is if you pre-order it, you get a day early. So I actually get to play it on the 3rd of November, which is pretty damn cool. Now, the reason why I'm bringing this up is because I am thinking of doing a Road to Commander style series or something along them lines when that game is released. If, however, the multiplayer winds up sucking or being really bad, I probably won't. And some of you guys may already know, uh, well, older subscribers may know, I've never made any Call of Duty Vo Ghosts videos on this channel because, well, to be honest, I really hated that game. The multiplayer was probably the worst multiplayer I've ever experienced and you know that's I don't know it's just my opinion you know don't hate me for having an opinion if you have your own opinion on Call of Duty Ghost multiplayer then by all means you know you can share them just don't go out of your way to try and damage each other's I don't know self-esteem by having an opinion you know it's again not very nice and some of you guys may also know that, you know, I did used to do Call of Duty Black Ops 2 videos way back in the day. I did uh, Zombies videos as well. I did a few multiplayer videos. So, you know, it'll be nice to get back into the Call of Duty scene again when, once uh, Advanced Warfare comes out. And again, I must I must stress, this, uh, this is entirely dependent on if Advanced Warfare ends up sucking. If it does end up sucking or being really bad, then I won't do any videos on it. If it doesn't suck and I really like it, then yeah, I'll go ahead and make videos on it. And on to GTA 5. GTA 5, ladies and gentlemen, I am a tiny bit salty with uh, GTA 5 at the moment and Rockstar Games because they have delayed the PC release even further than it already has been, which is absolutely fantastic. 
And the reason why I'm bringing this up is, again, I'm thinking of doing some GTA 5 online shenanigans sort of when the PS4 edition comes out. And just to give you guys a bit of info, it is officially known now, if you look at Rockstar's latest uh, GTA 5 sort of PS4, PC, Xbox One sort of release video, uh, the PS4 and Xbox One editions are going to be released on November the 18th, 2014, and the PC edition is being released way later on the 27th of January 2015, which is... Uh, which would make it the longest wait for a PC port or PC edition of GTA ever. So, you know, again, a little bit salty about that, but I guess I can go ahead and enjoy the PS4 edition in the meantime while waiting for PC to come out. So, yeah, what's going to happen is if I do decide to do some GTA 5 videos, I'm going to do them on PS4 first, just so I can get sort of the next-gen experience, and then once the, P uh, once the PC edition comes out, so then I'll switch to that, and I'll make some videos on that, so that'd be pretty cool. You know, I could probably, well, especially on the PC edition, I could probably get the guys, Astonishing Gamer, Moo Moo Mage, all of them guys on there, so that'd be pretty damn cool, but on PS4, I don't know if that can happen, because they've all, I think they've all got Xboxes. Not entirely sure, not entirely sure, don't quote me on that. So yeah, GTA 5, PC, delayed, great, okay, fantastic. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, it doesn't matter. Let's move on. The final thing I wanted to mention is a game called The Crew. I have pre-ordered it on PS4, and the reason why I've done so is because I've seen a bunch of The Crew videos on YouTube, and it looks like a really freaking fun game. It looks really fun. Basically, from my understanding, what you're able to do is you can buy cars, and you can upgrade them visually and by performance, and then you can, for some reason, drive around the entire United States of America looking for races and stuff like that. It looks really freaking cool, and I, uh, well, some of you guys might not know, but I'm actually a big fan of uh, racing games. I do love them. I've been playing Gran Turismo ever since Gran Turismo 2 on the PlayStation, so, you know, that's pretty cool. Obviously, Need for Speed is another thing I like, so, you know, that'd be nice to try and get into a different racing game, but... You know, I haven't really tried doing racing games on my channel, and there's normally a good reason for that. You know, while you're doing the races, it's really difficult to do a live commentary over that and talk about something while also trying to get into the game and try and win the races. Do you know what I mean? It's, it's, pre it's pretty damn difficult. So, you know, it would be a pretty interesting uh, sort of direction to take with a channel, even though it would just be a branch out and be a new direction, because I wouldn't just convert this channel into a racing only channel, that'd be a stupid idea. Oh man, I don't want to do that. I've got loads of things I want to do. But yeah, I'll be honest with you guys, I'm a bit on the fence as to whether or not I want to do an LP on that game. So we'll have to see how things uh, look nearer the release date, so you know, that'd be pretty cool. Oh my god. Has this been one hell of an update video or not? My god, it's been a long time coming, like I said. <laughs> oh my god. But yeah, this has been a massively long update video, and I do appreciate you guys for watching. If you do have any responses or feedback with regards to any of the ideas I've put towards you guys, or any of the updates, or if you think I've forgotten something out of this update video and you want to know something, just ask it in the comments area below, and I'll be sure to uh, take a look and maybe respond to them. So that'd be pretty good. I am still reading the comments area of my video, so don't worry your faces. I'm not just leaving you guys so that's all good but uh, yeah i want to thank you guys for watching if you did enjoy the video and you're excited for the new content to come on this channel be sure to hit that thumbs up button and of course you can subscribe if you want to know when the future videos are out so just to clarify november will probably be the month of the new games advanced warfare officially coming out on the 4th of november the crew is coming out on the 11th of november which is exactly a week later and then gta 5 on ps4 is coming out a week after that so 18th of november so it's going to be a pretty crazy month in terms of content for this channel so <laughs> again i'm really excited to try and branch out the channel get some new things going and uh yeah well also i don't like to mention milestones that much because you know yeah, i don't know i feel kind of big-headed for doing so but we are getting fairly close to hitting 50,000 subscribers as well and that's that, that is the craziest number it really is i never thought i'd make it this far on youtube and you guys have helped me get this far so again Thank you very much, it's much appreciated, as in, like, probably from the bottom of my heart, I really don't know what to say, I just, I extend my gratitude to you guys, you guys are absolutely amazing, I do appreciate you guys watching and leaving feedback and all the like ratings and everything like that, so, again, thank you. But yeah, other than that, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.